What's up fam? This is Jonathan for Pixels and Bytes and I got some exciting news. As you guys should know already, this Tuesday, September 12th at approximately 10 p.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern, we are gonna go ahead and be exposed to what is the iPhone 8 or edition, whatever you wanna call it. As a matter of fact, this is everything you need to know about the iPhone 8 before the release, before the announcement, in less than three minutes. Let's get it! What we have here is a 5.8 inch edge to edge OLED display, which we have never seen before because they have always gone with LCD. Second, an all new design with an all glass construction, which means no button in the front. As far as we know, we do not even know if there's going to be a fingerprint scanner whatsoever on the phone. It is rumored to possibly be the actual iPhone logo in the back. But what seems more likely to me is that we're going to have some type of new upped rendition of a facial recognition system. And what this is going to allow is basically to just look at the phone. I mean, I don't know how they're going to implement it, whether it's going to be like Samsung. I'm pretty sure it's going to be better than Samsung. Um, they tend to take whatever technology is available and they enhance it to the next level. Uh, but we do see that there will be no fingerprint button as far as we know. And also we have another thing is that it actually supports wireless charging. So of course we know that wireless charging cannot work with metal phones. And uh, that brings us to the conclusion that this is gonna be a glass iPhone. All this comes with the Apple A11 chip. And another thing that we actually see throughout the renditions, which is actually a rumor that's been so consistent that we're absolutely 100% positive is gonna happen, which are the vertical cameras on the back. Instead of being horizontal, we do have vertical. I, I don't. I don't know why I did that. And of course, iOS 11. Lastly, let's get into the price. We know that <laughs> without the shadow down, this is gonna be the most expensive iPhone ever. The most expensive iPhone ever. So expect for that wallet to get crazy skinny. Just, just you know, plan on being broke unless you got it like that, then kudos to you. Me personally, <laughs> my wife is gonna possibly hate me, nah, I'm just gonna, she, she loves me too much, she ain't gonna hate me, right, right baby, no? But anyway, yes, this is gonna be the most expensive iPhone ever, so be prepared, we're talking about probably between 800 for the base model, all the way up to about $1,200 of gorgeous green money, so that's gonna be a pretty penny, like I like to say, and for those of you that know Evan Blast, which is known as at Evie Leaks, he actually announced on September 2nd on Twitter, that he has also heard the name being iPhone X, not really iPhone 8 or 8S, so that's just uh, one thing to know as well. And he also quoted September 15th being pre-order date with a release of September 22nd, so take it as you will. But I think we're gonna go ahead and have an iPhone in our hands soon within the next two weeks. With that being said, let me know down below what you're most excited about. What feature? Is it the display? Is it the fact that it's OLED? Is it the fact that it is expensive as hell? I don't know. I don't know what you like, but you know what? You can tell me. Hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. There's a notification key. Buy the subscribe. Hit that so you know every time I upload a video, I'm going to upload more. I promise you. This is all I have for you. Thank you so much. Mi familia, my family, my people, mi gente. We out. Um, so maybe it wasn't exactly under three minutes, but uh, it was under four. Four minutes? That's cool. Cut me a break. Cut me a break. <laughs>